As you can see by the title of this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you my whole entire journey on how I made my first million. If you are new around here, please drop a like on the video and subscribe with bell notifications on if you are new as I'm smashing out weekly content and you don't wanna be missing out on that. Now, before we dive in, if you haven't watched my video on how I made my first $100,000, please click the card that's above here. Make sure to watch that before coming back to this video as it's gonna make a lot more sense. But if you don't want to watch that video, you just want to know how it went from 100k to a million, then keep watching. Now, after dropshipping on eBay for around, you know, that one to two year mark, after working at McDonald's, after selling lollies and everything like that, we got to 100k. And from 100k to a million, there was one thing that I focused on and I was consistent at that made me a million dollars. So what I decided to think about was if I can make 100k, I've only got to do that 10 more times. So that's where I was like, if I can do it once, I can do it 10 times. So that's where I was like, you know what? Let's build up another business. So what I decided to do was create a education company. Since I had so much success in the eBay dropshipping space, I decided to make this company as when I was working at McDonald's, there was no mentor for me. There was no mentor on planet earth that had the step-by-step -step guide, that had all the videos in perfect order and also that one-on-one -on -one support. I never got that, hence why I decided, you know what, let's make an education company to help out other people that are kind of in the same boat as me. And that's where it all started on my TikTok account back in 2019, posting content on there, sharing my education company. And I think I started selling this program at around $50. It was very low at the time, just to get things rolling. I had no idea on what to price it at and everything like that. But you guys are gonna see later in this video on how it is at this price today and hence why so many of my students inside of the program are getting really good results. Because when my program started selling a lot at $50, I'm like, well, maybe it can sell at 75. So at 75, and then it went to 100, and then went 100 to 200. It kept going up, and then when it hit 200, I kind of hit like this, this stop where I couldn't move forward, and I'm like, I need to get more guidance. Because the problem is that I thought that the longer I wait, the more information we'll have. But the thing is, that's not the case. I'm gonna need a mentor. I'm gonna to need to find someone who's already crushing a million a month so I can learn from them to even make, you know, 30 to 50K and go from there. So the first month after launching my program, I did $5,000 in profit. Do note at the time, the people joining this program were making really good profit. Like I was getting screenshots of people making, you know, 1,000, 3,000, $10,000 from this program. And I was really happy when I saw people getting results from using my strategies. Now, if you do wanna apply for my one-on-one -on -one mentoring program, you can click the first link in the description and schedule a free strategy session with me and we can go from there and see if you're gonna be a good fit. So now that my program was working, I had success, it was all about rinse and repeating, getting those repetitions in, posting on TikTok consistently, and then driving up the traffic and obviously getting people inside of the program. And this is where, after my first month doing 5K, I stumbled across my first mentor the next month after. Now this mentor was great. It helped me with setting up all my Instagram settings, all my scripts, all my TikTok page, my thumbnails. And from there, as I said, it was just rinse and repeating, putting in the clockwork. And what I mean by clockwork is by stuff that you have to do every single day. So making TikToks, responding to messages, helping out students, seeing if there's any student results to share, everything like that. And in that month of October, I still remember, I did my first $10,000 a month. And when I hit my first $10,000 a month from my education company, that was just feeling like a bonus because I was crushing already on eBay. This was just an extra step. This was back in 2020, I believe, when I started this program. And now it's nearly 2023 and we're still going very strong. I continued selling the program, obviously getting really good student results. We started going to 10, Okay. And then we hit December, we did $30,000. That was my biggest month. That was my first $30,000 a month, basically doing $1,000 every single day inside of our education company. Student results were going absolutely crazy. And the reason why I hit $30,000 that month was because one of my videos, this video right here, hit over 20 million views on TikTok. If you haven't watched that video, check it out. It's got over 2 million likes and my DMs were flooded. I had 99 plus requests for days. I had so many people rushing in, so many people wanting to join the program, I could not keep up. And this is where my mentor came in clutch and he taught me about scaling. Now, scaling your business is an important part if you wanna make more money without working as hard by outsourcing the work to other people that are better skilled than you. This is where I hired a TikTok specialist to run the TikToks, I hired someone to do the DMs, it's called appointment setting, and I also hired a closer. 
I hired these three people to do most of the work for me to get my time back so I can focus on the marketing side of the business. And obviously with a lot of people messaging in and a lot of my team doing most of the work, the sales went crazy. And a few months after December, I hit my first $50,000 a month and that was really crazy. When I hit $50,000, I was on my lawn rolling around like a little kid, like I've just won the lottery, just to celebrate of how much success that was. And do bear in at the time, I could not keep up with the student results because that's what makes me happy. When I see student results inside of my program, that's the best feeling at all. And by doing this over time, I kept going 50K next month, 65K, 70K, 80K, and all the way up to 100K in one single month from my education company. So a lot of people online, they say, oh, you must have seven income streams to become a millionaire. And that's not true. What I found is that you need to find one income stream, do it consistently, do it long enough, and make sure you're doing the repetitions at the right things. Because a lot of people do repetitions at the wrong things, hence they don't get results. I know people that have seven income streams and they're only doing like $1,000 on each of them every single month. You want one solid income stream that's performing really well, and once that's automated, then you can bring on another income stream that's gonna benefit you further. That's one mistake that I made when I was first starting out. I was like, no, I need to start affiliate marketing. I need to do drop shipping on Shopify. I need to do drop shipping on Amazon. I need to do all these business models. Just pick one and stick with it and do it long enough with the right guidance. Simple as that. And you know, prior to me making a million dollars, I was, you know, doing the habits, doing, being very disciplined and working really hard on the business, even though I haven't really seen any results when I was first making kind of money and everything like that. I just want to put that out there and no one believed in me at all. It's the funniest thing. It's the craziest thing, but not really actually when you think about it. No one is going to be there to support you when you haven't made it yet. But I knew there was a spark inside of me that was saying, Josh, you're going to make it no matter what. Your time hasn't come yet. Even though the money's not there in your bank account, the time is going to come. And that's what kind of fueled my fire. I had haters. I had people, you know, I had a lot of haters and that's what fueled my fire. And that was not a bad thing. And when I did make it, you know, I wasn't like, you know, stuff you, screw you to all the people. I let the silence do the talking. And that's one thing that I kind of learned as well, that once you make it big, sometimes it pays to bite your tongue. And when I did over $250,000 from my program, I knew I only had to do that four more times. And given how much success we're having inside of the program student results wise, that was not long until I did a million dollars recently. And that's right. When I hit 18 in October of 2022, which was a few months ago, I hit a million dollars in sales. Do bear in mind though, that is not profit because there is taxes, there is expenses, but a million dollars in sales for me is a huge milestone that I was always wanted to achieve. The next milestone is a million dollars in cash. I don't care about revenue, I care about cash. So when I get to a million dollars in cash and I can actually show you my bank account and swipe and refresh it and show you, I'm really excited to make that video when I get there and I'm not far off. And one thing back when I was first starting my program is that I was charging very low for my services. And that was one thing that I thought was, you know, no, people aren't gonna join this program for this price. That was a limiting belief of mine. Fast forward now, the program is well over four figures and people are joining the program and getting really good results. So it's been a really good investment for most people, as you can see on my Instagram, if you do head over there, at Ecom Josh Carter. Make sure you hit the follow on the Instagram if you have not already. But that's kind of how I've made a million dollars. Yes, it's not the beautifulest way to make your first million dollars online. You probably guys are gonna probably flame me in the comments for getting there through an education company. But the thing is, it's not really about the money for me, it's about the lives that will change inside of the program. I would never run a program when I'll just do it for the money. Um, that's not motivating me. Student results motivate me and people that use my strategies from where I was at McDonald's, from where are, whatever their job they're working, if they're not even working a job, they join my program and they get results from it. That's the best feeling in the world and I really can't replace anything with that. Another lesson I learned was when I was making a million dollars in sales is that you wanna be very careful on the mentors you pick. I know they said this in my other video on how I made my first 100K. Like I said, if you haven't watched that video, click that link above there. Be very selective on who you work with. There's a lot of people out there that are just there for themselves. I mean, I'm all for being for yourself and everything like that, but when you, you know, you've been burnt by a few mentors in the past, it's very tough to overcome. And do bear in mind, guys, I've spent well over $100,000 in myself on mentors, courses, programs, workshops, seminar. There's no way you can do this without spending money in yourself. 
Because the difference between me and you right now is the skill capacity. How much we know in the space, that's the only difference between me and you. Hence why I've kind of been able to make at least a million dollars already. Not here to brag or to impress you or anything like that. I'm just showing this to impress upon you. That's actually possible. I used to be this broke kid that used to work at McDonald's and now I'm comfortably making, you know, 50 to 100K every single month recurring. But yeah, that basically sums up the video. I really hope you kind of found some value or kind of got an insight of how I made my first million. A lot of people online, they give kind of a false hope of how they've kind of made it. But this is the full transparent way on how I've done it. Made my money in eBay at the start and then further grew it with my education company. And that's how it came about. Yes, it's not the prettiest as I mentioned. It is what it is. And I'm sure most people have done it this way as well. So like I said, if you are a beginner and you wanna get in the space, you can just apply for a free call with me below. We can hop on a strategy session and see if we can help you. And like I said, if you have video suggestions, drop them in the comments below. I'm posting weekly content. Make sure you subscribe with bell notifications so you don't miss out on any future uploads.